Hello, everyone. Real is dad here. So, a while ago, I made a video showing one of my characters using the male strat to level from 42, I believe, to 70. And I asked if anyone would like to know how I did this as a casual player, who's pretty busy all the time, to let me know in the comments down below. Well, someone left a comment down below, and that's all it takes for me. So, Let's get right into how to do this. First of all, you're going to want to make a time running character, obviously. Now, I assume you already have a 70 because this is more of like an alt method. So, get that time runner, make whatever class you want, preferably tank or healer because it'll make this process a whole lot faster. But it doesn't need to be that, just expect to wait a little bit more. Now, after doing that, as soon as you have entered the game, you want to go get your cloak from the very first quest. Now, here, you can either do little quests as filler or immediately queue for heroics and take that route all the way to 25. I, I do have to change my bear skin first and foremost. He's having... I cannot exist without my cool bear skin. Another thing I forgot to add at first is if you've done this before, gems help a lot in this process for tanking, so you might want to find a way to give that to your ult via a friend or some other method that I don't know about, but you want to get your gems onto your fresh so that these heroics are very quick. The more gems you have, the more tanky you are, the less risk of death you have. Something I also wanted to add is you want to try to pick up your trinkets and rings and your necklace if you've completed that achievement from the gem procurement or procurement, whatever, the gem merchant, <laughs> the gem merchant. You want to get your items. So just wanted to throw that in there as well to make sure that you get that, those items before you start this journey too. Now, 25 matters a lot, and we'll go into that later. But first of all, why you're doing heroics. You're doing heroics so that you can get those little blue XP tokens, but you're not going to loot them. Now, here's the thing. There's add-ons out there that can filter your loot, or I think it's no bonus XP or no loot XP or something like that. There's an add-on strictly for this that loots everything but the XP token, and then also for mail, will open everything but the XP tokens. Now, I'll try to put the name of the add-on on the screen when I actually remember it, but when, what you do is you're gonna run heroics, you're just gonna spam heroics, basically, and you're gonna leave those tokens to go to your mailbox at the end of the run. When you leave anything on a mob, and you leave that instance, it goes to your mailbox, like the items, your, um, even the threads, all that stuff goes to your mailbox. So if you leave only the XP token, it'll be a very clean mailbox of just XP tokens, but you don't have to do that. If you have the add-on, you can always go back and then, you know, just loot everything but the token, tokens, the tokens using the add-on. So next step, when you hit 25 after spamming your heroics and all that, make sure you kept the tokens. Don't loot them even though it's tempting. When you hit 25, you can queue for LFR or find a group doing a normal raid. At that point, you're doing it for the thread that goes to your cloak. For LFR, it is a 7% thread that goes to your cloak at the end of the raid. Very quick stuff, but still 7%. For a normal raid, it is 12% to your cloak per boss. So for the very first raid that unlocks, you get six tokens, XP tokens, as well as six 12% threads. So for every raid, usually these raids I've found take anywhere from 15 to 20 minutes to, because there's always going to be some kind of carry in them at this point in time. So that being said, it's about 20 minutes for 72% to your cloak. Now, you leave the purple tokens just like the rogue tokens, and they go to your mailbox, and you'll have six of them, I believe. So then, at that point, you, make, you can make a decision. You're 25, 
you can either just do a raid daily on that character and narrow your amount of time played because then you can have multiple 25 ults who are all doing these raids for threads and you can do the raids every single day and still get 12 percent to your cloak for every boss every day so here you're starting to understand the strat i assume so as you do this over time, your cloak becomes 400, 500, 600, 700 percent XP bonus. That's when those tokens come into play. Now, I usually get bored and do like some heroics and stuff. So I'm usually around level 40 to 42 by the time that I open everything in my mailbox to go to 70. But, like I said earlier about the looting add-on, that add-on also tells you what level you'll be if you were to loot everything in there. So that's another perk to that add-on. But usually I get up to about that level, and I'm only about like four tokens off of 70. So I go four over, I mean. So I'm, I hit 70, and then I have four extra that go off for no reason. So I'm usually pretty close around that level. But I've also never done just a raid a day. So it may take you a long time, but I assume your cloak will be at like 900% like plus or something. I think basically one purple token might take you up like three levels at, at that point or something, right? Like so, so you wouldn't need too much. But yeah, basically why this isn't that time consuming is because you only have to do that one raid. Getting to 25 takes about an hour if you're slow. And I'll show that as well in the background, that it took me about an hour to hit 25 on the character that I was starting to do this on. And as you can see, I already have quite a few just from right now. And my plate is going to be about an hour-ish, I believe. Yeah. I had a lot of time AFK, so I've spent about an hour on it so far just to hit 25 and do that raid. So there you go. So that being said, you put about an hour in time of time into that alt, and then it's about 20 minutes a day if you wanted to take the long route to 70. But if you did that, it's 20 minutes a day per character. You can probably do it with quite a few ults if you just have a little bit of time. So, like I said, the raids unlock daily and give you 12% per boss, plus the, you know, the purple XP token that you get to keep in your mailbox. So it's, it's up to you how much time you want to put into this but i believe it had 45 days left when i checked today so 45 days is more than enough time to do this strategy for multiple characters even with the only 20 minutes a day being put into each one using this method my five-year-old has two 70s as of now a druid and a mage yay luchi you got your I first 70, Luge. I did it. Yay. Good job, baby. You did it. So, that being said, I hope you enjoyed the strat and it wasn't too drawn out. Get out there, guys. Use this strategy. Many ults as you got time for. And I hope you guys get as much bronze as you can and get every item you want. See you guys in the next video. Realist Dad and... Mama! Out! Out! <laughs> like the video and subscribe. <laughs>